Okay, Steve, let's have a look at 27 Grouse House Mark 1.27. As you approach it from the uh, the northwest side, you can see obviously it's growing in stature. Uh, we are limited on space somewhat, but um, managed to highlight it and make it look a lot less drab and dreary. Converted the the red rocket into a nice little nice little habitable home obviously as you can tell I'm crazy about these string lights brother this is what it's all about as you can tell we've got turrets and this is where Preston normally puts himself uh, to um, ward off super mutants and raiders that's a pretty intimidating wall of turrets um, I've just actually upgraded to gun nut too so i might be able to get some machine turrets obviously some more for this side i spared no expense on the defenses brother yeah the, these little turrets will fuck you up if you approach grouse house um we're a little bit lacking on this side don't worry the, the project oh there we go no we're not lacking at all strategically placed little turrets um let's have a let's have a little wander shall we and see what new delights await everyone in 27 ground so you will notice the unfinished uh, ramparts there and that is because apparently it's outside of build area or for some reason it wouldn't allow me to um to left the door open okay knock knock here we go guys oh codsworth Cards hello Shall I accompany you? no 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 thanks not now All right then. right so, got some nice Christmas trees as you come in, and uh, obviously this is brilliant. I'm a big fan of this. If Codsworth get out of the way, if I've got any rads, I can just decon myself as I go through, just to make sure I'm nice and, and neat. You know, there's a, a bar there. There is also um, a turret. Uh, so a watch guard is obviously observing for people coming in. It's night time now, so I've allowed them the night off. And normally they'll offer you a refreshing Gwinnett brew as you come on in. Um, we've got some settlers doing not very much in the garden there. And then obviously we've got defence ramparts here, uh, which are well lit up. As you can tell, the two-storey defence ramparts... Um, it just looks, it looks absolutely phenomenal. I've got a nice little campfire here for my minions. Um, growing some more vegetables around here. Um, here I've got a, a comms tower, which is completely useless. And then I've got some up lights on, on the uh, perimeter here. <laughs> a random street light in the corner. Uh, a nice little water tower, which unfortunately is is catching no rainwater because I've built over the top of it. Um, and again, yeah, just more 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 foliage and plants. We're, we're very self-sustainable here. We're subsistence people. I've lit up my Nuka-Cola sign, so it's uh, a little bit more visible from the distance. And that there, let me just take you up to the to the defence ramparts here, Steve, as you can have a look. Obviously, we've got a walkway to the lower ramparts. Again, either Codsworth or what's-his-face puts himself here, and we can go up to the second level of ramparts. Just look at my little minions, guys. Oh, look, there's Sanctuary. Didn't know you could see Sanctuary from over here. That's, that's interesting. Um, this is just temporary scaffolding to help with construction. So I wouldn't worry about it too much. It will be probably got rid of eventually. And obviously, you know what Red Rocket looks like inside. My my meager offerings for my uh, for my power armors, which will be they're temporarily housed. We will be getting more. But then welcome upstairs, Steve. Welcome. Who's left the door for fuck's sake? Welcome. Come into the porch where we've got some nice rubber mats on the floor to to take. Stop leaving doors open, guys. Fuck's sake. Uh, you can take off your shoes and stuff and grab yourself a Gwinnett Ale or, you know, some Nuka Cherries or some water or vodka, whatever you fancy. I've only got a couple of rum, though, so, you know, save those for a special occasion. Shut this door now. 
Uh, obviously, red rocket from above looks quite nice. Uh, we've got our Fallout boy and Fallout girl here, just to greet you. So you know, so you've got a nice feeling of aesthetic. And we've got a, a bamboo door. It's like to open the entryway. Here we go. We're inside now. And we're keeping it low key in here, brother. Right now, uh, you know, some campfires, some candles. I don't want to go too harsh on the lighting. I do want to try and figure out switches. Um, but yeah, as yeah, obviously we need a bit of heat when it gets cold. This is out to the back. Not decided what to do. They'd probably probably make a gym out here, little rack area. Um, I need to sort out these steps as well. A bit of a trip hazard. Um, that's the first floor, brother. Let me take you up to the the second floor again um obviously this is exposed somewhat because of this red rocket uh so by the um by the exposure i've obviously put the fire just to heat up any air that comes in um yeah so you know might keep it as an open space might allocate some rooms i do need a bathroom uh, i could do with going for a poo at some point and another <laughs> another floor up here um I mean, it's same principle just put some little campfires down please ignore the fact that this structure is made entirely of timber um and is incredibly uh flammable and yet i've just got naked flames everywhere so this will be the third floor brother i i am as yet to complete it i need to get my second floor shack floors down there because uh yeah i've come up against a build limit in terms of area not numbers but uh, this will be a third floor i may go two walls high so i can actually cover this little rocket here which obviously as you can see i've illuminated um and what's going to happen up here is i'm going to have my open top um power armor factory which will essentially act like um an anthem sort of exit way so once i've got my ooh, that's a travesty there i don't think i can actually cover that can i because uh once i've picked up a power armor i can just leap off the edge i won't do it now because i'm not in my power armor so um but yeah no brother i am also out of wood <laughs> which is something that i never thought i would be so i'm having to try and accumulate more wood um but i've been sidetracked very much by by the light situation which as you can I'm sure you'll appreciate is is absolutely fucking delightful. Let's go back outside. Shall we just keep the heat in, please, guys? Um, this is just look. It's just a far. Cr oh, I forgot to say, welcome, welcome, Steve. You know, so and that there is 27 Grouse House. Have a great day. 